Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Miracle Monique. I post Christian and lifestyle videos on my channel and today I'm going to be giving you guys some tips on how to get over a breakup. Put a man above the one I serve. Can't change what's happened yet, but of course I did get hurt. Real world life soaked up in these words. I'm actually really excited to be doing this video. Getting over a breakup is hard, and I think, like, the reward after getting over a breakup is the fact that like there's light at the end of the tunnel <laughs> so we're just gonna get right into this video if you guys are new here my name is miracle monique i post weekly lifestyle christian videos on my channel go ahead and press the subscribe button and turn on my post notifications so you guys can get notified whenever i drop a video coming to you guys with the consistency so i'm really really happy about that the first tip that i have with getting over a breakup is prayer Okay, so prayer is like super important whether you're getting over a breakup or not. Um, definitely pray over your situation and pray that God will heal you and understand that God will heal you. Prayer, you know, it, it's obviously honor, glory, and praise to God, right? But um, definitely know that God can help you through any circumstance, any situation that you are fa facing. And, you know, healing is not an easy process. Um, but when you pray, you are asking God to remove that hurt from your heart, right? You're asking God to remove that pain from your life and understand that he will do it. Um, so pray over your situation, pray over your pain, pray over your hurt and understand and know that God is there for you and he is going to heal you the next tip that i have is to read your bible okay so just in general prayer and reading your bible is super super important um but when we are going through trials and tribulations especially when we are going through a heartbreak right uh that's when we need to trust in god the most and we need to lean on god um and know that you know he is there for us and also know that god will never take something away and not replace it with better the third tip is to communicate with yourself i say communicate with yourself because sometimes you know when we're going through that healing process when we're going through that breakup um we tend to we tend to kind of we tend to more so cry right um, then actually communicate within ourselves. Um, and when I say communicate, is that just really have communication with you, reflect um, on um, on bettering you. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying to reflect on, you know, um, the badness or anything like that. I'm saying to reflect on the things that you can work on um, because a relationship takes two people, right? um sometimes you do have one-sided relationships but you always want to reflect on your actions or reflect on the things that you can do better as a partner because um, we all need growth you know and developing um our character and developing you know our worth right um so always reflect you know and communicate with yourself it's not your fault that that person walked away from you because 10 out of 10 they walked away for a reason they weren't supposed to be there in the first place um the fourth step is to surround yourself with positive uh people uh, surround yourself with positive things um you know and that just goes to say don't distract yourself just surround yourself with positive people and understand that you are going through a healing process understand that you are going through a breakup um, but be positive, you know, don't dwell on any negative situation. Don't dwell on the what ifs. Don't dwell on, you know, what could have been better or what, you know what I mean? Like, don't dwell on it. You can reflect about it, but don't dwell on it. Um, but be surrounded by positive people. Be surrounded by positive things. Do what you love. Um, and just better you, you know? The fifth step is to trusting God 
trusting God that he is going to send somebody better and trusting God that he is going to make a way out of no way. Trust that you are going to get get through this. Um, no matter how long it takes, that you will get through this. Everybody's healing process is different. Um, don't ever distract yourself, you know, from your own pain um, and understand and know that things take time. Don't ever want to distract yourself in a way of hopping into another relationship when you're not even healed from the last one. Um, so take time to get to know you and better you and understand that, yes, breakups are hard, but it's not the end of your life. <laughs> you you are amazing know that you are amazing you are great you are unique um and whether you got rejected or whether somebody walked away from you know that god is going to send somebody better i love you guys i hope you guys got some tips or whatever and i'll see y'all in the next one